Hello. In the last three lessons, when we covered the sketch tools, line, rectangle, circles, and arcs, you may have noticed the green marks or these green graphics appearing next to geometry. These are called automatic relations, and that is what we will be covering in this lesson. So, let's begin. Notice I'm still in a sketch, so I'm going to line tool, go out to the screen, and select my first point by left mouse clicking. When I move the cursor away from this point, notice as I move in my cursor or the line to the near vertical position, a yellow automatic relation appears. If I left mouse click, that vertical relation is applied to that line. Let me create another vertical line, but this time I'm going to select that relation and tap the delete key on the keyboard to remove that relation from that piece of geometry. Now, notice this vertical line has an automatic vertical relation. If I grab the very end of the line, I can move the line left and right. I can make it shorter, taller, however I can take it out of the vertical position. While this line over here, I can make it shorter, and taller, but I can also move it out of vertical orientation. That because that one here have the vertical automatic relation. Now I'm going back to the line command and I will draw a line goes in this direction here. Now notice I got these two yellow lines in the screen. These refer to inference lines. If I move my cursor above this one, I see an automatic relation of perpendicular, or I move it above this one, collinear. So I will move it back here and place an automatic relation of perpendicular. And notice my next point, the same thing, perpendicular, collinear. Or I can simply move it in different direction and not have an automatic relation applied. I'm going to tap escape key to end out of line command. And notice, when you place your cursor above a relation, you will highlight the geometry that relation relates to. So, these two pieces of geometry will always remain perpendicular to each other. So, if I grab this end point, Notice how those two lines are always perpendicular to each other. Next, I'm going to draw a circle. And notice the circle is highlighted. I'm going to the line command, select the edge of the circle, and notice while I'm moving the cursor, that line is tangent to the circle. I select a point, you can see a tangent automatic relation along with coincident automatic relation. Coincident is when two pieces of geometry share the same point. Next, I'm going to select this line first before selecting the line command. Then with this line highlighted, I will select a point out here. Notice I have a parallel relation here or perpendicular. Let's go with parallel. Before we can close this lesson, I want you to take note of the fact that as we build sketches, these automatic relations are added automatically. That's why we call them automatic relations. And in the next lesson, we are going to look how to add relations manually and how to apply dimensions to the sketches. So that was all for this video. Thank you for watching, please don't forget to like and subscribe to get more. Have a nice day and until the next video.